Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for hanging out with me and checking out another song. Now we're gonna do a song uh, that was um, requested by, I think, the ba a band member. Uh, they contacted me on Facebook and, uh, you know, I don't use my Facebook a lot. I don't really care for that platform, but um, it was sweet of them to let me know about their music. The problem I have with it is that I don't speak the language and it looks, uh, the title is Sehosta y Pohuta. Um, I don't know if I said that even close to right, and I'm just not going to even attempt uh, the name of the song. I, I have no idea. Um, but nonetheless, I still want to play it, and I appreciate the, uh, I appreciate, uh, the inquiry and letting me know about your music. It sounds like it's uh, a new release. Uh, really, it is definitely a new release. I, I remember her telling me, and I'm looking at it here on Spotify. It's uh, 2022, so it looks like it comes from maybe like a three-song EP. And we're gonna get right on into it here and get started with this. So let's check it out. <laughs>
for a sec. I like the drone in the background. Was that the engine? Boom, boom. Nice. All right, good stuff. I like that. Um, definitely, man, that drum beat was just like going off there. It was so fast at one point. Um, a lot of guitar stuff. It was pretty, pretty, uh, 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 pretty saturated guitars. It sound there's multiple guitars, at least two. Maybe there are more than two parts for sure. Um, maybe not, but for sure. Uh, but very saturated sounding guitars. Um, so you have to listen real hard to hear some of the intricacies of what some of those guitars were doing. Um, you know, I could hear some lines kind of down buried in the mix, uh, which made it kind of interesting. Uh, maybe, maybe I would have liked them a little louder uh, just to give it more, uh, to, to give uh, more distinction to the song. Because uh, other than that, the music itself is pretty, pretty washed. Um, which is a sound, you know, that's, it's fine. I liked it. It was good. Um, but there was some, some cool things going on there. I wish I didn't have to work so hard to hear, uh, is what I'm saying. Um, vocally, the, uh, the harsh vocalist, I liked him. He was good. Um, and really, I think the standout on this was the drummer. I definitely liked that guitar line, how they broke down into the doom, bing, ding, 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 ding. Um, <laughs> and kind of give you a little break and give you something else to listen to um, and then go back into it again and then finish out. Uh, pretty cool. All in all, I would say um, I give it a definitely an A or a B plus or an 11. I don't know. It just depends on the scale. It could be like five out of five. It could be four and a half out of five. You know, it could be nine out of 10. It could be three out of five doctors recommend this song um you know depends on your your scale and what you're working with but definitely liked it good stuff all right well i thank you for the recommendation definitely we'll see if we can uh get some interest in hearing some more um on the i'm not going to try to say the name again um i might need some help with that down in the comments if you can phonetically say it in English for me so I don't mess it up next time uh, I tried my hardest on the uh, name of the band I hope that was good anyways uh, we will see you guys in the next video down in the comments please leave a remark down there let me know what you thought um, if you liked it or if you maybe liked it enough to hear more and make sure you check out my patreon and my ko-fi you can re recommend songs over there that help out the channel so we'll see you guys later and you guys have a great day whatever's left of it and we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.